Hi, it's Kena. Welcome back to my closet. And it's time for an update for my lip service, Fantastic Ladies collab. I am very late because I've been very sick and I am so sorry that I've been gone. I would much rather have been filming videos, but oh my God, so sick. <laughs> so I'm glad I'm feeling better. I'm not all the way there, but good enough. So let's get into my lip service update because I've been dying, quite literally, to get this video filmed. So let's do it. All right, let's start with the uh, lip scrubs because you know. So I have this one, it's the Hanalei Sugar Lip Scrub. It's like lemon and sugar and I still can't smell anything, so that's awesome. But you know, I'll show it to you. That's where that is. I haven't been very good about my lip scrubs, but I will get better at it. This one, the pure one, I have not touched, as you can probably see. Haven't touched this one, so we'll just skip right over that. I don't like the way it tastes. Maybe I should be using it when I'm sick. <laughs> okay. Then I had lip balms. So I've been using this Hanalei lip treatment and it was like full when I started. It was like up here and now it's like to the L. So been using this while I'm sick. So <laughs> my lips were so dry and like it was weird. It was like they felt like they were going to explode, like they were all puffy and dry. And so, yeah, I've been using a ton of that. Also in this project, I had this uh, Jersey Shore Cosmetics Moisture Rich Hydrating Balm in Peppermint. And I will show you that guy. That is it. Won't go up anymore. Can't get my lips up in there anymore. Not gonna dig it out. Really like this. I mean, it was a lip balm, but like it was a pretty good one. So yeah, I liked it, but it's gone. Yay. So I'm gonna throw it in the trash now. Yes. Okay. So for lip balms, was there more? I feel like there was more. Okay. So because I finished that lip balm, I'm gonna bring in another similar item. It's this It Cosmetics. Uh, it's called Vitality Lip Flush and it is in this uh, Je Ne Sais Quoi is what it's called and it's just like a pH reacting type of a deal. So it's clear like this. I'll just roll it all the way up so you can see where I am and where am I on the lid. Just over half way up the lid. So that's what that looks like. And yeah, I'm just using this as a lip balm because it's like very slightly tinted and it feels really nice. It feels like a lip balm. So I've been enjoying it that way. So moving on to the Model Co Illusion lip liner. I don't know if you could tell, but like, I think before I was somewhere around like here with the cap to the letters you see what I'm saying and then now I'm like covering the M somewhat so I have been using this not much not a lip liner person say that every time sorry but um yeah I have been using it so that's cool and the Tarte Lip Surgeons in Wonder this guy that never dies <laughs> so that's where that is it doesn't look like it's moved, but I have used it. I'm wearing it today, actually, with my uh, honeycomb from Bite Beauty. I kind of like those two mixed together. It's pretty good. It's kind of a nice peachy tone, so I'm enjoying that. But anyways, there's that. Honestly, I really haven't used much aside from my honeycomb. So there it is. And I love this. I think I've worn some of the other ones like once or twice, but I still have them in here. I still plan to keep using those. 
Okay, so that's it for like traditional. Now let's move on to liquid lipsticks. So I had brought in this one from the Balm. It is Sentimental, Meet Matt Hughes, the matte liquid lipstick, it's in Sentimental. And I used to like these and now it seems like maybe the formula has changed or it has been so long that I've tried a million better ones since. I'm not really sure. <laughs> But I don't like this. It's sticky. It stays sticky forever. I don't know if it used to dry down at one point because it was a couple years ago, to be honest, that I used it. So I don't know. But um, yeah, I don't want it anymore. I don't know if the formula's changed or if I just have grown out of it, found better things, like I said. But at any rate, I'm going to go ahead and declutter this. So that's kind of exciting. <laughs> gone. All right, next. I had pulled out these Too Faced Melted Liquid Lipsticks and it's like the liquefied long wear lipsticks. But so this one in violet is amazing. I, I don't know how I forgot about it, but I love it. So I am using this and I'm still working on that. I do want to use this up because it's pretty old. It's like probably at this point I think it might be my oldest lipstick because <laughs> I did declutter some that were really old but um yeah so it's probably the oldest one I own and I want to finish it up because I bought a backup of it I love it so so much so yes that now these are the other ones that I had in this is the uh, dream house it's uh, melted metal and this is tutu it's a melted metallic tutu melted metallic dream house um, multiple tries I gave these I do not like the way these look on my lips it takes me to a place in the 80s that I don't want to be <laughs> it's not a good I don't know it's like I don't mind a metallic lip to be honest but these just don't look good on my lips they grab like the dry patches and they're real uh what is the word I'm looking for patchy they're very patchy so I'm gonna call it quits with these two I got them at Marshall's and they're not really known for having the freshest of products so that might have something to do with it so Maybe I'll try a metallic one someday from them and um, see if it's actually just that these are just too old. Uh, but for now, I'm chucking them because I do not enjoy these. I tried. I tried to see if it was just like that day that my lips that day, whatever. No, just don't enjoy them. I'm chucking them. Gone. It feels really good because I have like... I just did my inventory and I have way too many lipsticks, which I already knew, but um, yeah, it's gone up. Somehow I just bought a whole bunch more. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking, but anyway, let's go ahead and move on to the next items, shall we? So I have this Noya lip gloss in Malbec and you're not going to be able to see any progress in there. You can see some little bit of air there but um, I have no idea if that's indicative of progress or not because it's been there forever and I have a feeling that it's kind of like hollowed down in here because I use this I don't know what's wrong with it so there's that now the other one I've been using is this method to the madness is the color it's from trust fund beauty and let me just get up here and show you this one I don't know if you could see it, but you see this line between fund and beauty? That is the level of the product. So I would say I'm about a third of the way finished with this. I still enjoy it. I'm going to keep using it. Um, these are like the two oldest lip glosses I have. So yeah, I'd like to get through them and move on. So at any rate, that about wraps it up because that's all the lip products I have in front of me. So we're done. Um, yeah, I'm not going to replace anything. I am going to be doing a, I'm still doing like using my lipsticks, but I'm going to kind of switch that up just a little bit in format. So, um, 
keep an eye out for that. And as a result of trying new lipsticks through that project, I may end up putting some in here, but I think I'm good for now. I have like two lip balms, a lip liner, two lip scrubs. I have five traditional <laughs> lipsticks and I have two lip glosses and one liquid right here is the liquid one. That's my only liquid. So anyways, I think I'm okay for now on lip products and yeah, I might throw some in here. Uh, like I say, as a result of my other using my lipsticks. So keep an eye out for that. Anyway, I'm going to go back to laying on the couch and trying not to be dizzy. <laughs> so you guys have a good one and thank you so much for your patience. And, um, I hope that you all didn't just leave me because I was sick. So <laughs> sorry about that. And I promise I will do better. <laughs> I'll try to like, I don't know, pre-film some stuff just in case. Uh, but let's just hope I don't get sick again. So anyway, that is everything. And thank you for hanging out for my ramblings and I will see y'all next time. Bye.